Thank you, Matt. A Berrien County teen convicted of murder is hoping his fate will change. 19-year-old Dakota Elison was just 14 when he shot and killed his step-grandfather. He was sentenced to life in prison without parole, but he's appealing that sentence in a hearing today, asking the judge for a lighter sentence. WSBT 22's Annie Chang is live outside the courthouse in Niles. Annie, several of Elison's family members testified today. For both the, def the defense and prosecution, Jennifer, the point of this hearing is for a judge to determine if Eliason should get a lighter sentence. Right now, he's serving life with no chance for parole, but because of a 2012 U.S. Supreme Court ruling, that fate could change. Judge Schofield will decide if Eliason should be resentenced. Based on the Supreme Court decision, juveniles should only be sentenced to life without parole in a very, very rare case. This afternoon, Eliason's father, Steve, and cousin Dylan both took the stand. His father testified that he had been an alcoholic and drug user during Eliason's childhood. His cousin Dylan testified that Dakota acted oddly. He seemed to be very affectionate growing up, even to strangers. Dylan says looking back, that behavior seems even more weird given that Dakota murdered the grandfather whom he seemed to love. After he murdered my grandfather, I had to look back on everything and it just really showed me. I'm sorry, it just really... It showed me who he really was. Now, during this testimony, it was very, very hard, I noticed, for Dakota to look at his cousin Dylan. He went at great lengths to, to avoid making eye contact with him. While his father, Steve, was testifying, Dakota tried to wipe away tears and tried really hard not to cry. We're told Eliason's sister, grandmother, and then Eliason himself will speak to the court tomorrow. Reporting live in Niles, I'm Annie Chang, WSBT 22 News.